In this video, we will discuss about technique used in cell biology. In previous lecture, uh, we will discuss about the microscopy, tissue culture, paper chromatography, and uh, various other techniques, electroporosis. In this video, we will discuss about the spectrophotometry, micro dissection, and micrometry. So, spectrophotometry. Spectrophotometry is derived from three Greek words spectro means spectrum, spectrum means beam of light are uh, rainbow like bands of color formed by the rays of light pass through prism photo mean light and metry mean measurement it is a uh, techniques used in cell biology uh, to detect uh, spectrophotometry is used to detect the chemical substance by measuring the light absorbed by the substance or uh, we can define the spectrophotometry a method to measure how much a chemical substance absorbs light by measuring the intensity of light as the map of light pass through a solution. Or we can define that it is a technique used to measure the change in percentage transmission of light, which is known as optical density of the suspension material, is known as spectrophotometer. Here, uh, a single principle uh, is used in spectrophotometer that a, each compound absorbs or transmits light over a certain range of wavelength. Basically, the spectrophotometer consists of two instruments, spectrometer which uh, produces light at any selective color at any wavelength and photometer measuring the intensity of light. Spectrophotometer is basically used in cell biology for the determination of various types of amino acid. As you know that there are 20 different types of amino acids present in all living organisms from bacteria including uh, from bacteria, protists, fungi, plants and animals and these uh, amino acids uh, you know that they absorb specific uh, wavelength of light. These amino acids can be de determined with the help of spectrophotometry. These are the device uh, uh, or these are the apparatus which is known as spectrophotometer in which uh, uh, carried out various types of processes and it composed basically of a spect photometer and a spectrometer. The another techniques which is used in cell biology is micro dissection. First of all, micro mean small dissection mean to cut off into smaller pieces. Dissection of cells and tissue by means of fine needles that are precisely manipulated. Or we can also define that dissecting of cells or tissue under microscope usually by the precise manipulation of specific needle is known as micro dissection. There are three methods or uh, three different kinds of techniques used in micro dissection. The first one is chromosome micro dissection. The small cutting of chromosomes are parts of the chromosome from the whole chromosome by using specific needle under the microscope is known as micro chromosome micro dissection. The second technique is known as laser micro dissection as you know that here the cutting of various types of organelia or the selected structures and cells under the microscope by using the laser is known as laser micro dissection. And the third one is laser capture micro dissection. Here, uh, the cutting of the organelles are selected material or cells uh, under the microscope. First of all, it will attach to the laser, adhere to the laser, and then the laser is responsible to cut the that selected structure, cells, tissues, and organelles. And this method is known as laser capture micro dissection. The last uh, techniques uh, which is used in cell biology is micrometer, micrometry. Micro means small, metry means measurement. Can be defined the measurement of microscopic object is called micrometry or we can also define it measurement of actual size of an object by using micro uh, measurement of actual size of an object of microscope using micrometer is called micrometry there are two types of micrometers uh, these are two types of micro scales that they are used in micrometry these are the stage micrometer which is used in the stage on the microscope and these are the ocular micrometer which is used on the eyepiece of the uh, microscope. The ocular micrometer as the name indicates that it is a type of a micrometer which is also known as eyepiece reticule. It is uh, made up of glass, a, a disc 
and they are placed within the eyepiece. That's why it is known as ocular micrometer. And the second one is a stage micrometer, as the name indicates, that is a type of micrometer which is uh, placed on the stage of a microscope and glass light on which 100 equal lines are inscribed each line of each line of 0.0 mm or 10 micron meter then important method here uh, for the calculation of uh, reading is known as calibration or adjustment of scale in order to calibrate the ocular micrometer for a particular objective lens the ocular and stage micrometer are superimposed that when we see the actual uh, uh, specimens uh, within the microscope to determine their actual size the ocular as well as the stage micrometer will be superimposed in number of ocular graduation first stage micrometer graduation is determined as uh, it is given here in the formula for uh, uh, simple version that one ocular division is equal to spaces on stage micrometer divided by spaces on ocular micrometer which is equal to 0.166 as we know that one space of stage is equal to 10 micron meter so one line of ocular is equal to 1.66 micron meter so it is very easy method that uh, we determine here the actual size of the microscopic object uh, by using the micrometer within the microscope so this technique is known as micrometry if you like the video please share subscribe and watch thank you